In this video, I'm going to be showing you how I go about repainting lens markings on legacy manual lenses. Here I've got a Canon FD 50mm 1.4 SSC, which must be over 40 years old now. And although the lens works really well, you can see the lens markings there on the side have yellowed a bit over time. So I'm going to be repainting them. And to do that, I'm using Humbrol Enamel Modeling Paint, which you can get from any modeling store. This is the number 22 gloss white. Also, a bit of Humbrol paint thinner just to remove any excess. I'm also using a couple of Q-tips, a thin paintbrush, a latex glove just to protect your skin from the paint thinner, and a thin tissue. It has to be a thin tissue, not something that's thick or cushioned, as that could work its way into the grooves and remove the paint you've just painted in there. So first of all, protect the elements by putting both lens caps on. Then fill the paintbrush with a good amount of paint. Make sure that you have plenty of paint on the brush. Then just fill in the whole area around the number, making sure that you get it right inside the grooves where the number is printed. Then take in the dry tissue, wrap it tightly around your index finger, making sure it's nice and tight. And then just wipe straight across over the area you've just painted to remove any excess paint. You may have to go over it a couple of times. And you can immediately see how the 1.4 there looks nice and bright and white compared to the yellowed numbers next to it. To remove any excess white paint that might still be on there, you can just use the latex glove and dab a little bit of paint thinner onto the tissue and then wipe over it once again. Once you've got the hang of it, to speed things up, you can try painting in a couple of lens markings at the same time. Here I'm doing the F2 and the F2.8 aperture markings. Again, the same thing, cover the whole area with paint. Then with the dry tissue, wipe straight across where you just painted to remove the excess. And then again with the tissue, just dampened with a little bit of paint thinner. And that's it. You can also repaint other markings of different colors just by picking up the right color enamel paint. 